Yep, go for it. So the task data file is loaded on a USB stick. We're just going to pop that in. Just the terminal. And press start import. So that automatically comes out then? Yeah, that just pops up automatically. And then select the task data file. And then the RF for upload. And then it asks you whether you want to actually open that file, which you can do. So if there were multiple files that you would you could then choose which choose. one you want to open. So it just says task data, will it give you a field name at all? If you had, um, no, so, so because the file in, in the USB stick has to be named task data for the terminal to recognise it, um, it's only once you get into the task you can then see the, the field name. So if we right. go into, if we now go into uh, the, the menu at the top with the three horizontal lines with tasks, we can then see the field within that task. So, for example, here we've got Dobson. So, if there were more fields in that task data, you'd be able to see that. You'd see them all listed here, and you can select the field you want. And then, if we go now onto that, that field, you can see the variable rate map for that, uh, That's that right. field just there. Brilliant. Thank you. So, to find out what activations are on the terminal, you go to the three horizontal lines in the top right corner, and then head down to service and activations. So here you can see you've got task management, which is TCGO. You've got GPS application, which is TCVRA for variable rate. And then obviously we've got SACL 15, GPS pilot, and, and RTK uh, in this terminal. Brilliant.